I mean, there's yeah. people who will look for things from decades ago and write articles about how offended they are by it today. I found one from Vice recently about you. Did you see that with the headline, Nobody Needs a New Jerky Boys record right now? Yeah. You know, the guy's yeah. right and it's offended by everything. See, I have experience with this because they tried to do this to me 30 years ago. Okay. Uh, and it was Tipper Gore and, and, and Al Gore's wife. And they tried doing the same thing with me 30 years ago. The jerky boys are offensive to Muslims, to gays, to Jews. To blah, 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 blah. They went down the list. It sold millions of records for me. Millions of records. You know why? Because my fans know that that is bullshit. They don't realize my fan base is privy to what they're up to. The jerky boys are crazy, insane characters that get themselves themselves, self-deprecating humor, they get themselves into situations that are insane. Yep. So that article looked to me like it was written by just a whiny, complaining woman who just, oh, oh I don't, I probably never even listened to the Jerky Boys. No. But I don't, I don't, I don't get it. I don't get the Jerky Boys. Yeah, and, so and, then goes and, writes, and, and then goes and writes an article well, okay, great. Go do your thing. You yeah. get up in the morning. You you get up in the morning, and you're looking to be offended. And you're looking to be yeah. down your nose, and you're looking to be uh, just a, a good. Go live that life. If that's yeah. the life you want. Go live it. So she writes that article, and I believe it was only a week or two later my record comes out. And what do you think my brand new record did? Straight to number one. Absolutely. Straight to number one. It sold out at Amazon. My fans. Do not fall for the bullshit. Like I not said, if you get up in the if you get up in the morning and you're yeah. miserable and yeah. you're looking at, I don't like that. So yeah. you don't like it. So you're going to tell other people they shouldn't like it. Why don't you just get up in the morning and just try look, looking at it beautiful? You got sun shining on your face. Get out, have a great day, and stop worrying so much or stop worrying about what other people should. Maybe, exactly. maybe, maybe there's millions of other people who really enjoy it. Right, you know, it's and, crazy. And, and what's sad is that they, they, they're so miserable that they take these jobs where they have a platform to kind of write these hit pieces and all that. Just to yeah. feel like, like how sad is it that, that that makes them feel good? They need to do that. Me personally, I don't get it. And I don't I don't even have the time a day to even try to think right. about it because it's it's such a miserable it's such a miserable place to even be. To put your, I don't yeah. want my head over in that spot, you know. 